Hi folks and welcome to the Classex headquarters. I'm Barbara Dinocenzo and I'm a sales manager for Classex. So today I'm going to interview my IT engineers and the head of development who will tell us something about anti-latency integration and how we use this technology in our LifeBoard XR for doing augmented reality and virtual sets and so though mixed reality. So stay tuned, I'm going to show you. So hello there, we have Michele. Michele is uh, Director of Development uh, of Classics. So, hi Michele, welcome to your headquarters. <laughs> and so, the first one would be, what is LifeBoard? Oh yeah, LifeBoard, very, let's say it's, um, uh, it's a composed word with uh, live and board. Live is, means everything. No, live is live. So every kind of application for live events, from live graphics or live everything is handled by live boards. And boards, well, means a lot of things in English, but the word live board means graphics broadcast or broadcast graphics <laughs> if you want. We have just one machine to do all this stuff. We have the 3D stuff, we have the subtitles, we have the green screen and we have all the tools that you need to create your very own broadcast graphics. So my question too is what is anti-latency? Well, uh, the name means more or less what, what can I understand is that uh, is they are uh, is a good company that really they are really fighting against the latency and I think they did the job because the anti-latency tracking system is a, a very nice and unique system to keep track of your trackers. So very easy to, let's say, to build up and uh, easy to handle just because they have a good SDK and so it can be integrated in your application. And so anti-latency is a good tracking system. Very stable, very performant, and so we like it. So hi, we are now with Dario and Dario is an IT engineer at Classics and did uh, a great job in integrating anti-latency. So I have questions for you as well. Anti-latency is a tracking system really stable um, that providing us that provide us the uh, position in the virtual space in order to do in order to track the virtual camera and virtual objects. So um, the latest version of uh, uh, anti-latency SDK support the 3D protocol and uh, we support the 3D protocol as well so the integration was really quick and fast and uh, this setup is uh, really really easy and yeah that's it. Okay, so the integration was really quick. We uh, just add, we just added uh, a new preset in our preset list. Anti-latency gave us a really nice support and really smart support. Uh, yeah. So um, we use uh, we in, in the broadcast industry we uh, use anti-latency uh, in two ways, two common ways. Uh, the first one is, uh, at, is by touching the, um, the tracker on, on the camera and then we can track the position of the camera and we can move our virtual camera in the space. And the second one is attaching the anti-latency tracker uh, to the person and then we can uh, track the position of the person in the space and uh, the person can walk around the virtual object in the virtual space. So, yeah. Well, that's also very easy because uh, once you have a tracking system complete like that, it's very easy to use uh, is that, um, let's say, your very own tracking system for camera. So you, you can think of moving uh, your cameras freely in your uh, environment or even do uh, talent tracking whatever you you think is possible so you just 
connect it to the tracking system and apply the sensors through the cameras and you see the results in real time. Thank you Classics engineers and a big thank you to the anti-latency company who lent us their floor tracking system. Liveboard XR and anti-latency are a perfect binomial for the real-time broadcast quality, tracked augmented reality and virtual set.